It was all in the cookies. Hi everyone, I'm David, and welcome to Homemade Goodies, where we cook good eats and make sweet treats. And to kick off this new season, we'll be making a simple, yet very delicious entree, quesadillas. When it comes to making quesadillas, I used to just simply put cheese on a tortilla, stick it in the microwave, and call it a day. But earlier this year, I decided to start using a griddle and actually cooking meats for the quesadillas. I started off with chicken, and now I sometimes use steak. And so, let's jump right into it. For utensils, you'll need two cutting boards, two large knives, two pans, a spatula, a griddle, two sets of tongs, two large serving spoons, a paper plate, and two paper bowls. And for ingredients, you'll need a chicken breast, a ribeye steak, cheese, tortillas, and fajita seasoning. First, turn your griddle on to high heat. Next, prepare your meat. Place your chicken breast on one cutting board and cut it up into small chunks. On your other cutting board, cut up your steak. Then, add your chicken to one pan and your steak to the other. Once that's done, turn on your burners and start cooking your meat. And now, add fajita seasoning to the chicken and the steak. Stir them together until your meat is cooked. Once your meat is cooked, turn down your burners to a simmer. Next, load one of the paper bowls with chicken and the other with steak. Then, set two tortillas on the griddle. Add your meat and cheese to one side of each tortilla. Now, 
well. Fold your quesadillas over and let each side of them cook for one to two minutes. Then flip over. Keep doing this until you reach your desired amount of crispiness in your quesadillas. And once that's done, you're ready to serve and eat. And there you have quesadillas. And so I hope you enjoyed this episode of Homemade Goodies. Be sure to join me next time. And until then, keep on making. It was all in the cookies.